Hello everyone, my name is Demon Killer and today we will be installing VirtualBox 6.0 on our Ubuntu operating system. So first we are going to open our browser which is Firefox in most cases and we are going to go to the VirtualBox uh, website just search in VirtualBox uh, and now it seems they've made it 6.1 but it's okay, it doesn't really matter uh, we are going to click on the Linux distributions Ubuntu is Linux distribution and you can see that a variety of distributions are supported here CentOS 678, Ubuntu 18, 16, 19 Debian releases, Fedora, so so many. We are going to look on the Debian based Linux distribution uh, because Ubuntu is one such. And uh, what actually has to be done is we have to download and uh, register this thing via this key. So as you can see here, it's already expired as of VirtualBox 3.2. So it will be a hassle if we do this manually. So they have really pro done a nice thing by providing this uh, combination. Just copy it and you can open a new terminal window here I'm going to expand it and paste it so we have to copy both of them right you can enter your password here go back to your browser copy the next line uh, and paste it here okay now so what we have to do is go back to our browser again and via this uh, so-called PGP uh, address we are going to download so our uh, VirtualBox file so just let's copy this and we are not going to paste it directly I am going to show you what to type I am going to type in sudo add apt uh, repository and then now you are going to paste it and ok don't click enter first replace this my distribution with Xenial okay you don't uh, if you are on 16.04 then only uh, replace it with Xenial otherwise I'll tell you what to do just give me a second uh, just give me a second okay uh, we actually need to put these in uh, quotation marks I guess Paste it here, put these here, replace this with denial, and yes, so now we are done. Okay, so what you have to replace my disk is I'll tell you shortly. So you can see it's Eon in Bionic, Zenial, Buster, Sketch, whatever. So, how do you find out what's your uh, distribution name? So for example, you are on Ubuntu 18.04, just search on the Google, and you can see it's Bionic Beaver and similarly on 19 it's uh, probably disco yeah disco dingo whatever you call it uh, ubuntu mine is called zenial zeros i will just show you zenial zeros so the first uh, name of that distribution will be what you have to uh, type in over here in uh, replacing this uh, where is it Hang on. Uh, this my dist you have to replace with the first name of your distribution okay so with that done what we have to do is uh, skip all this and come here so we can copy and we'll update our system as you can see it's working okay so now we are going to go and copy and if this doesn't work we have another alternative as it is given and I'm going to say yes so it's working okay as you can see it's working just give it it's time to okay this process takes on your internet speed okay to be really honest so mine's working around 1.2 mbps So it will take its time, just uh, let it download. Okay, remember when uh, it asks, do you want to continue? Like uh, they will install some 99.4 MB of archives 
an additional 236 MB of disk space will be used so you'd want to say yes just type in Y okay more than 50% of uh, the downloading is complete Okay, we are almost done. Three fourth of the downloading process. Still running at 1.2 Mbps. Okay, and now we are done. It's going to unpack and install our VirtualBox 6.1. So this time uh, it will be 6.1 and not 6.0. Uh, I don't think there will be much difference apart from a few bug removal processes or something so it shows it's done but uh I'll just wait for the line to come. Let's check by the way, is it done? It should be done. Yes, it's done. We have VirtualBox 6.0. Okay. One last thing that you would want to do is go on this website, click back, go to uh, extension pack. This is really uh, something useful, so you can just download it. Okay. Uh, and it's again for 6.0 6.1 and it automatically got detected so I'm going to just click install I can scroll down I agree and okay so you need to type in your password I authenticated it's installing the extension pack and yes it's done so now we can add in our from here you can add in our ISO files directly import if you have an OVA open virtualization format so that was it this is how we install uh, VirtualBox 6.1 technically right now on our Ubuntu operating system thank you so much